Today on Tanaka Homestead, I'm going to build a portable chicken run. We purchased wire, wire cloth with one inch squares. And actually, I, I was a little nervous about this, thinking this might be too big, but this is perfect. We bought 50 feet of it. Then I purchased these spikes and um, they, they're like fence posts with these little spikes. So hopefully they'll go into the ground. And um, we're gonna connect these uh, to the wire cloth. And my goal is to make an enclosure that's safe for the chickens uh, to run around, but I didn't want something too permanent. So that's why we went with this. Uh, so that when we move our chicken tractor, we'll be able to also move this with us and set it up however we want. I went ahead and started attaching these. What I think might be good is I, I attach them. They have these little clips here and I've been counting 42 squares. So every 42 squares or 42 inches, I attach one of these. And um, I'm thinking this will work out, but we'll see. These are 42 inch panels, I guess. And I keep going back and forth. Should I put this on top? Should I not? You know, this netting is supposed to be very durable and have a some sort of load strength of, I don't know, I just remember X amount of pounds and it sounded good to me. So I'm gonna try this. I'm gonna attach it. My biggest concern is just making sure it's sturdy and it's durable and my chickens aren't gonna get out. Um, but I guess the only way to find out is to set it up. I don't want them to be able to get out here. So I'm going to use this just to make it a little more sturdy. And then these are easy, you know, zip ties. You gotta, I think that's pretty good. So here's our finished product looks pretty good. So I ended up using this net, which we did yesterday. Um, it feels pretty durable and it's a nylon netting and I really think it'll work. We were concerned, my husband and I, about visibility and we didn't want other birds uh, to get caught up in this. So I installed this rope. Hopefully it's visible enough, we'll find out. I used carabiner clips to attach the netting to the frame of the fence. And I did that around the perimeter of the fence just to make sure it was secure. And over here at the front, what I ended up doing, you see that I think they really like it. Same thing, I used the carabiner clips and I attached it. And the reason I went with the carabiner clips is it's gonna be easy for me to get in and out and access the door if I need to. Thank you so much for watching our channel. If you haven't already, please click the subscribe button and I hope you have a good day. Happy chicken raising. Bye.